Hey everyone, welcome back. I first want to uh, apologize for no audio for this first uh, seven minutes of this montage. I think uh, my mic was not synced up with the receiver and it just came out this way. But there was some good footage so I wanted to share. So we were out with our friends um, Marcus, Chris, Greg, um, our brother-in-law uh, Robinson, and then uh, this is what happened. So this up here, this is uh, Chris, and this is the first time she's ever fired any weapon. And you can see by her body language and her face, facial expression, she was uh, extremely nervous. But Paula was there, and off camera, you didn't see, he walked her through all the um, standard safety features and, you know, correct stance and posture, as well as, you know, basic holding and handling of the gun. So she... Uh, made it through this first round this is the 43x so this was nine millimeter later in the day i believe she did fire the 45 um, but it was just a little bit too big for her she didn't like it that much but uh, everyone had a, a great time and this is the only new shooter so she got uh, some special instruction from sir paulo and i think this magazine she only hit the paper one shot but the fact that she didn't give up the fact that she you know went through the whole magazine is is good and she obviously had fun because look at her face now my wife got the scorpion out this time and this is the first time um, this day that she was shooting the scorpion so she's got a little practice with the gun so that's why she's pretty good here so she, we back up a little bit because we like to practice a little farther bit away so you see right there first shot on target and then second shot on target and then third shot right away on target. So she was three for three right at the gate. And then uh, trying to find the one of the last targets there at the end. So she was able to find it. And, <coughs> excuse me. So, we, you know, we did use the Evo a lot this time, the Scorpion. We had a lot of fun with it because our friends hadn't fired it before. So uh, it got a lot of use. So we put 400 nine millimeter rounds down range between the scorpion which ate up most of it in the 43x and then uh, i got to get out and shoot 100 rounds of 45 through the glock 30 which is a new gun we had the first time at the range so everyone got to use that um, it was quite obviously louder um, extremely loud when you're inside the actual range itself here is uh sir paul letting chris try the scorpion i think she only used the scorpion twice well, you can see her posture was off here, but he corrected her real quick. Now, you'll notice that even for a first-time shooter, the red dot does help because she'll take a shot here, and uh, I think her first shot actually um, is on target. And then I think she's ready to say, okay, I did it, and quit. But then uh, everyone convinced her to go ahead and finish the, the targets, and you'll see how she does here just fine. Now, Paula's loading the magazine for her and racking the first round just because she doesn't have the strength and, you know, she's already nervous enough. So he's showing her that if the gun's heavy, which it can be, to just go ahead and let it rest for a second and bring it up right before you fire. And that's what he's showing there in this video. So you'll see she's on target. She makes one shot. Then she's done. <laughs> okay, so um, another minute, no sound. I'm going to narrate some more and then watch the rest of the video. I do appreciate it. If you like this kind of content, hit the like button. If you have any comments, please go ahead and leave them below. Thank you. So in the configuration of this gun range, uh, the echo was really loud. Even I, when I was firing the 45 later, was going to use my headset. Um, a few people were complaining about ringing in their ears later because it is definitely a, a loud gun. I actually enjoyed firing it back at the end of the range where I wasn't um, sighted by walls just so the echo wasn't so loud. <coughs> But everyone got to fire it. I mean, it obviously, is there a big difference between a 45 and a 9mm? Um, everyone did pretty well with the either gun. Um, we put 100 rounds of 45 downrange and 400 rounds of 9mm um, 
by the time we were done for the day. Now, some of the reasons we put a lot of, of ammo down, as you'll see here in a, in a second, um, is we let the guys do some hip firing, you know, and blow through 20 round clips, um, just spraying down range, just for the fun factor of it. And then uh, we were also practicing shooting from quite a large, long distance, right? So we were um, doing some sitting down here and shooting, which is, you know, obviously completely different sighting. And we didn't mess with the sights at all. So it was kind of just eyeballing how to put them down the range at these little tiny targets. But overall, everyone had a good time. I'll let you watch the rest of the, the video now that the sound's going to be popping up here in a minute. Um, if you like this kind of content, please uh, subscribe. And if you like to see more or have any questions about the range or what we're doing, just go ahead and leave a comment below. If you're new to my channel, I do appreciate the views. And I would like to thank all my new subscribers that have popped in in the last two weeks. I was very excited to see that bump up in subscriptions. Uh, welcome to my channel. You'll see different things here. Um, this happens to be just range day, so you'll get some range day input here. With that, I'm going to let you go ahead and enjoy the, the remaining seven minutes with commentary from the actual shooters themselves because I did fix the mic. Thank you. There you go. Good shot. Good shot, Marcus. Good shooter. Thank you. Another day at the range. How'd you like that? I liked it. You liked it. I need more practice. All right, baby. Go. <laughs> Just practicing. You need to practice, get used to the snap. No, <laughs> Huh? Heavy? Yeah. It's a heavy gun. It does heavy things. Why at least? Oh, I, don't th I don't think the plates are going to be an issue here. No, I'm probably not going to be able to <laughs> hit one of them. You're just going to ta 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 You know, it's like I want to film from that side because it looks better. Right? Because, uh -huh. you know, you're holding the gun. You but then all the casings fly in my face. <laughs> and they do fly. They do. You gotta get a sling for this thing. I have one. It's in the bag. I absolutely have a sling. Because you can wrap the sling around your arm and it helps stabilize. Yeah, I absolutely have a Although sling. Although this doesn't kick worth a shit, so it doesn't nope. matter. I imagine if it was, you know, a 5.56 five, or something like that, it, you know, it would. It would. But 9mm in, in that size package, there's enough weight on that to, to, to keep it steady. <laughs> Remember, the shells fly that way. <laughs> and that's a hip fire. Okay, 
What, what can't you do? It's not going, I can't get it to slot. Why? Uh, flip up. Oh, yeah, well, let's go for it. Forward. Yeah. <laughs> Hot gun. <laughs> oh, you're just above it. Oh, that's right. This dot is weird. Yeah. I forgot about that. Rambo style? Go for it. <laughs> that's ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> Open the stock, it's easier, and then check, check the chamber. And that's a hip fire. There you go. It was already on the back. I need to cycle it one more time in order to... No, I think you just put one in there. Okay. You'll find out. Safety. Red to shoot. <laughs> oh, you killed the barrel. I don't believe you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm definitely on the three. Aim a little further over to the right. I'm trying to see where you're hitting you in the dirt. Don't. Oh. That's not comfortable. <laughs> <laughs> You're to the left. You went to the left? Yeah, you're, you're hitting to the left. The dirt in the background is to the left. So you need to move right more. How yep, about that? Right oh. above it. Right above it? Yeah, right above it. There you go. So I'll edit out all these misses, and I'll have one, <laughs> one, one shot of you. <laughs> I can't see. Finished.